Hello, Pisces, and welcome to your gemstone reading for the week of March 22nd through the 28th. No, it's not a coffee cup this week. I'm trying to have my voice recover, and coffee has been irritating it. A few days ago, I was around some significant dust. It's a long story, and I have allergies. And that uh, made me cough and sneeze a lot, affected my voice so... And the coffee has been irritating it. So I will resume with the coffee cup readings next week. So, and I'm going to try to speak as clear as I can. It is getting better though. I mean, I do, I, I do all the home remedies. I do everything. Believe me. I know and this is good. <laughs> so we will, um, I did also shuffle the card. So we will pull a card at the end too. So let's take a look at your messages for the week of March 22nd. All right. You've got a lot here. There's, there's been a lot. There's just a lot. Um, something connected to the past um, was frustrating. There was maybe an upheaval with people close to you, family issues, something like that is showing up because the home and foundation was in the gray. Um, but this has brought something together better and more of a, um, a spiritual epiphany, an um, emotional epiphany. There is something there. Um, what I'm seeing here, too, is there is a lot of changes going on. Um, you're evolving spiritually, psychologically. Also, this is purging. And also, this is um, uh, philosophical changes here. We do see what is of value. I like to explain this tower. A lot of people get confused. I've noticed with this tower, because I have a few stones that are a tower. But this one, when I say this is your earned income or things of value, Things of value do not always have to be money. It is what you, um, how you feel about yourself, how you value yourself, your insecurities. So we do see a big change there. So something had to happen to either make you feel more confident. For others, it could be change of income or value. We are seeing that. Partnerships, money, it's like trying to form something, but it is on the side. So we are seeing that. We see hidden stones underneath. So that indicates negativity. There's something that's still ongoing here. That's affecting you. Compassion, love. A lot of generous people around too. You got a lot of energies around you. Money coming through family, love and what you value. Uh, love is being refurbished and also in a way polished up. And there's a lot of uh, points being made with uh, relationships and things that, um, you know, things of value. It's like um, kind of deception around you and people who fake or they have another agenda and they just want to see what they want to see and want to uh, use what they can from you so there's a lot of that coming through um it's shining the light of the darkness here health and well-being it's been a rocky road here too there's some doubts but watch your health and well-being um i do see lifestyle needing to make some adjustments with your health and well-being too lifestyle adjustments are coming up this is like higher education, learning, um, advice and counsel coming through therapy. But this is very positive here to a lot of knowledge coming in as well. And passions and desires are working towards it and following your heart. So you have a lot of energies here this week. What I feel, um, there is something you have mastered. You have learned something, skills, money, great business deals. Um, I do feel also if you have your own business, there is something here that um, maybe you started that you should go back to. The time is to retract. If it worked, it's trial and error. But take breaks. Um, do things in small steps, okay? And just let things further develop themselves. Um, I do feel here also that you are coming to the end of a very stressful cycle um, where you felt... There's been sudden changes, endings, you've been hurt, realizing some have betrayed you. I don't know. There is that energy here. For some of you, this is an end of a negative cycle with finances. There will be money coming in. I do see that energy too. Um, I do see here you need to focus. Uh, I do see here you can definitely manifest a lot here. A lot of that you wish and desire is there. I do feel that one, at least a small wish is going to come to fruition here. When I'm looking at you overall, too, in your home, there is this energy of delays and uh, spiritual intervention. Okay, so we're seeing that. Um, there is something that is telling you, uh, be careful of the people that surround you. They have been negative or there's something around you that you need to be more aware of. 
Okay, so wishes will come to fruition here. It's like manifestation is high. When it comes to love, I do feel for some of you, it's a sense of seeing the clarity in a situation. It's delusional. It is like um, some people around that um, this is an all relationship. It's not just um, in a love relationship. It's like the realization of who's got your back, who doesn't have your back. And it's messing with your um, with your stability and security but there is blessings in disguise from this okay um if there's money worries or something to do with money with love is connected here too there are blessings coming in okay you have to have faith there are um, adjustments and changes that need to be made um work um it's like communication is very important forming some kind of a partnership is available to you um, talk is needed too. I do see with communication, this is like um, forming a union. It's very good. But things didn't turn out the way you thought they would be with some kind of either project or the way you've been handling business. There is some changes here as well. Uh, finances, I do see counting your blessings is going to be very important. There is some help around you too. And offers may be coming through too. Um, I do see an Aries energy. This is also taking more control of your own finances. There are um, I want to say more blessings than you realize um, there. Um, there is opportunities coming in. You're just not seeing it yet either. What you really need to know is there's been a lot of lessons learned, and I do see that you're completing projects. You're um, starting something new. New um, cycle is um, opening up here. I do see good news is going to be coming through too. I do feel that energy too. Um, I do feel also your outcome for the week looks pretty good. It's like it's more positive thinking. It's like more financial independence. It's like moving forward. Um, there is a difference in the way you make um, money. There is something that is kind of turning and changing with the business, career, work. You're almost there. You're almost going to either you're uh, the, this is completing a course or some kind of training. You're almost there. See a lot more positive thinking coming through here as well. So a lot of adjustment changes are coming through too. Man, very interesting. Okay, let's pull a card. And you have the three of wands. Okay, this is a strong energy here of communications. It's a three, a wrapping up loose ends, moving forward. Okay, so we are seeing that energy. Um, I do feel there's been lessons here that have been learned too. So it's like... I want to say what I'm picking up here is something that occurred toward like last year. I feel like in fall, maybe kind of like fall, September 21st and on, there is something that maybe you still have to tie up a loose end here or there's something that you're dwelling on disappointments then. I feel a lot of energies here connected. There's like Aquarius, Virgo, Capricorn or someone who exhibits those energies. And you're trying, you know, you're kind of either going back, reviewing the past there, but, um, and you're dwelling on disappointments. There is high creativity here. Learned experience is moving forward. This is good if you're teaching as well. I feel that something will be revealed. There could be a secret that comes through. Um, something maybe is revealed and that's going to create some sudden changes for you too, quick changes and moving forward. Um, I do feel that at least in the next two weeks, I feel you may get an invitation or an important event may come through too. Um, it would be advisable to not hang on to anything and move forward. New social circle, new beginnings, choices. I do feel that energy, okay? So you're there. You're getting there. It's like um, just tying up some kind of loose ends is what I'm feeling as well and moving forward, okay? Lessons well learned, okay? This is like a learning card as well. All right, Pisces, that was your reading for the week of March 22nd through the 28th, and I will be resuming the Coffee Cup readings next week. I hope you have a wonderful week, and I'll catch you back next week. Bye for now.